Hi there guys, it's Livy Boy 26 of 3 here. Welcome back to Football's a Pitch, episode 42. Tonight, Livingston welcome the Arabs Dundee United to Tony Macron Arena. Now, this game is a Friday night game on a 7.35 kickoff live on BBC Alba. That's right, a few weeks ago when it was St Mirren Dunfermline 1st versus 5th. St Mirren and Dunfermline got a game live on BT. Last week, 1st versus 2nd, no TV game. This week, 2nd v 3rd, we get a BBC Alba game. It's good to see that every team in the top five are getting equal opportunity in the telly, just like St Mirren and Dundee United are getting BT next week. We're the only team that can't seem to get a game on Sky or BT in that league, but, ah well, what can you do? Anyway guys, that's my rant over. Welcome to Football the Pitch. Today, Livingston are playing Dundee United. Oh, this is going to be a tasty affair. We're currently second, they're currently third. I think that's all I need to say, but last time they came to our stadium, we did win 2-0. When we went to Tannendice, we did lose 3-0 on the other hand, so... It's definitely going to be an interesting game tonight. What's going to happen? I'm going to be optimistic. I'm going to say 2-1 Livingston because we've been very good recently. I mean, that result last week against St Mirren was amazing. I think we're going to follow up with a win. But anyway, guys, I cannot wait. Come on, Livingston. Let's get three points. Oh, I love it. 
<laughs> this could be the easiest summary I've ever made. I can summarise it in two words. Ryan Hardy. What a goal. 90th minute to come out with a goal like that and I'm going to be honest, I like to say as a Levy fan I'm 110% optimistic all the time that we're going to win but into the 90th minute, the way Dundee United had been playing, the way the game had been going, I felt like they were going to sneak it and by sneaking it I mean they did not deserve to win. I mean, a few years ago Dundee United were like the second best team in Scotland for pretty much everything. It has just been a downfall that's happened at that club. I mean, a lot of Dundee United fans are saying that as well now, that it's just been a downfall and you could see that today. But, going back to the start of the season, newly promoted Livingston, what would be the odds of them beating St Mirren and Dundee United in back-to-back -back weeks? Because this is just unreal. I mean, I could not believe that goal went in. I mean, we were actually, we played really well in that first half. Second half, you could start to see the fact that Dundee United haven't had the game in so long, but we had a very hard game on Saturday. So, I it was one of those games that, did we deserve the win? I wouldn't, I don't know if it was 100% domination for Livingston, but if any team did deserve to steal the three points, it would be Livingston. Now this is also a momentous occasion for this channel. It's the first time I've ever got the prediction right at the start of the video, 2-1 Livingston. Another thing that happened today, I met Aaron from Football Mania. He actually moved up and sat next to us in the second half. Really nice shout out to him. He was watching the game as a neutral. He's a Hearts fan for those of you that don't know. He also had an interesting start at half time that he had never seen Livingston get any points whatsoever. So good to the first three points. I mean that goal for Ryan Hardy, unbelievable. And just the timing of it and the way it came. And it went out to the entire nation on BBC Alba. <laughs> but anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I am delighted. I don't know if you can hear, I've hardly got a voice left. That's what watching Livingston week in, week out will do you. And we're awaiting Morton on Tuesday and awaiting them on next Saturday. So, some big games coming up. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Please don't give a like, subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.